What's happening, guys? This morning, we are hunting for chicken. Well, really, we're kind of looking for the chicken man, but you get the idea. I've heard of him, yes. If, the, if you're talking about the guy that does the painting down on Joe yeah. Richard. During Arts Watch, I'm really cognizant of the high caliber of art around Columbia, and I'm not quite sure where he fits in. <laughs> Fair enough. Somewhere, though, right? In the Somewhere. Would you say in the pecking order? You never know where he is. He's like Batman. He is. He is. I think he needs to put up a chicken signal. <laughs> The fact is, Ernest Lee, a.k.a. the Chicken Man, has a residency on Hardin Street between Lady and Gervais. Chicken Man original. Ernest Lee, who hails from Edgefield, South Carolina, has been drawing since he was five years old and painting since he was 12. We were at a Shoney's up there in Taunton, Georgia. And I'll tell him about the bound chicken I used to have. We would just open a cup of carpet and having breakfast and stuff. I said, man, I ain't gonna pay no chicken because ain't nobody gonna buy. Well, buy they did, and in fact, in the last 11 years, Ernest Lee has certainly made his mark on the Midlands. But now little did I know I got about 15,000, I don't know, 10,000 around town. Interestingly enough, chickens were not his first choice. I really don't want to paint a chicken. I want to do everything else but a chicken. So, <laughs> but now that it worked, it's the best thing I could have done. The chicken man, who studied at the Gertrude Herbert Institute of Art and the Rose Hill Art Center, also paints portraits, often of the King of Pop, and a variety of other subjects, all of which can be taken home from his impromptu outdoor gallery. Oh, and did I mention fowls are a bit of a family affair? That's right. Not only can you get an original Ernest Lee, but you can also pick up a Scotty Lee while you're at it. I took it up when I was seven. Like, I want to go to the NBA, but if that doesn't work, then I just take up this. The Lees, or Chicken Man Squared, may on their coop each day on Hardin Street near Gervais, paint originals, do custom work, and autograph every single one. Cold winter days, blazing hot summers, all find the Chicken Man doing what he loves, sitting in his den, painting. Ernest Lee says 10 to 20 people a day stop by and take home an original, one-of-a-kind, Chicken Man. All right, guys, so I think a case can be made that if you live around here and you do not have a Chicken Man in your home, it's not complete. Stop by and see Ernest Lee, the Chicken Man. He's on Hardin Street, at least for now, by Gervais Street. I'm Tyler Ryan for Good Day Columbia, and let me collectively say for all of us, that was a chicken.